So this is a little lesson recap for Mr. Kyle. Today is the 24th of September. Um, we are taking on D and A seventh in our chords, and we're gonna learn the lead for Amazing Grace as well. So check over here. When you're building your D, you want to build one and three first, because as soon as you curve that three, that second one just falls right in. So one, three, two. All right, and we're skipping our sixth string when we strum. But the next chord we're learning is an A seventh, and this is all in the key of D. So you'll play these two right after one another a lot in the song. So here's our D, and we only want to lift our first and second fingers because our third stays on that second string. So A seventh, D. A seventh. D. And realize all my third is doing is jumping up, jumping back. So D. All right. Now, getting into Amazing Grace, you've got the first line written out, but make sure you're reading it correctly because when it goes up on the tabs, it's actually going down your guitar. So it goes fourth string open, four, three. Two, three, two. Second fret, third string, open. Fourth string, second fret, open. Then that same opening run again. Four, three, two, three, two. Second fret, third string, second string, third fret. Make sense? Did you see all the fingers? Mm -hmm. All right, cool. Well then, we'll do that for this week. We'll finish up the solo, or not the solo, the lead for Amazing Grace next week. And depending on what you got for your chords, hopefully uh, we'll get into some minors.